So what is up guys, Nick here. Welcome back to the More Nick Ackerman channel. Today I thought I'd show you my bike. It's actually right over there. But the reason I'm gonna do this is because, why not? We're gonna be covering, you know, you know, doing some more vlogs on the bike. So why not just show you the ride that I'm gonna be using? So let me flip it around and show you what I'm riding now. Oh, and by the way, the only reason I'm not wearing the mask right now is because you can see there's absolutely no one around super social distancing right here when i do get around people that mask goes right back on but you can see right here here is the bike like i said in the last video it's the trek amanda alr4 and uh, it is equipped with disc brakes so you can see right there that i do have disc brakes on there and it does have the shimano drivetrain it's a tiagra 10 speed so if you know anything about bikes yeah i also did throw my own continental gator skins on here hard shells these are 28 millimeter right there so you see if i get closer 28 millimeters let me see if you can see that let me get a little bit further down right about there i'm not sure if you can see it but they are 28 mil i also got this little bag on here it's a z file bag i got this from walmart it's to keep a little bit of uh storage items in here but you can see also right here it does say amanda alr4 now in addition to that you can see i also did add some carbon fiber stickers here this is to keep, you know, things off of the bike, like rocks and stuff like that. And right here, you can see that there is a Trek logo right there. That is the logo of the bike right there. Now you can see that the handlebars, I'm not big knowledgeable on the handlebars, but you can see right here, this is a 10 speed bike right here. Now, I also equipped this little Bont Traeger. It's like a, a speedometer on here. so. I could cycle through and you could see it has the clock. It will tell you, let you scan. It'll tell you how long you've been riding the bike. The distance, I currently put 637.2 miles on this bike. So I do ride it quite a bit. And I also did equip these bottle cages, these Ibera bottle cages. I'll leave a link to these down below. You can see right there, I got two of them on there. And these are also my own custom pedals. They do have some nice little grips right here. So, you know, you don't have to shoe, you don't have to lock the shoe in on these, but these little screws right here, keep your foot on the pedal when cycling. So it's a really nice touch to have on here. So also, let me go ahead and flip the bike around now. Give me a second, I'm gonna pause this recording. Let me flip it around, I'll be back. Here's another side of the bike. And you can see right here, we're gonna take a look at the drivetrain now. This is what powers at all and this is the tiagra the shimano tiagra and uh, this is a 105 uh, drivetrain i believe so you can see it right there i do keep it quite clean and all these gears and all this stuff was manufactured in japan so this is the real shimano setup this is the whole shimano setup which in bike terms is basically the top of the line you want to have all similar parts on the bike and also i do have these affinity tlr wheels on here they do black out and match the whole blackness of the bike I actually used to have a red bike it was a i think it was a specialized bike but it was so bright and everybody was staring at it so i got rid of it i like some a little more low key right now and so that's it that's the ride you're gonna see me on when you see the handlebars you're usually seeing it from this angle you're just seeing the handlebars like you see in the last videos but that is the ride also i did have this montro seat installed if i could find links to these things if you bike too you want to get something like this on your bike any of these parts i'll see if i can find some of them but that's it that's the ride for now it's not my only bike i actually got a couple other ones but these are the one this is the one i ride the most is my favorite bike and so guys that is it that is my bike review now i just want to do this i'm only gonna do this random video because we're gonna be riding on this doing some vlogs i might even do one right after we do this video right here but honestly, it's a great little machine. And I think that one of the things I wanna to get to with this video is that it's nice to have like a hobby or something like on the side that you do besides your productivity. This is my thing, I like to cycle. It really takes my mind off of, you know, the stresses of life and stuff like that. It really clears your mind when you get out and you can cycle. Now, I know right now not everyone can do this depending on your area. Thank you very much for watching. Have a great day out there. Thumbs up, stay safe, stay well. Nick here, peace.